All right, so I've opened the last battery here. This one looks like it comes with a 5S and a 4S. So I'm guessing five, two 5S's here, two 4S's here. And there's some more down here, and I don't know what it is. I'm guessing two 3S's or, yeah, two 3S's probably. Anyways, let's uh, get to it. How's it going, guys? We're back at the cottage. Let's see here, we got... 14.5 volts, uh, 19 amps coming in. Batteries are full. That's all these batteries there. And then I got some more, three more in this box. And this system has been running flawlessly ever since I put six of those uh, 180 watt panels on here. It runs the fridge. The lights in here it runs on occasion uh, a heat pump for like an hour or so just to take the chill out um, there's a lamp up top there's no permanent wiring really yet other than a little bit for this light here uh, no plugs yet but uh, yeah it's just been working really really well very happy with it and it's just running off of this uh, 12 volt EP solar tracer is a 40 amp uh, charge controller. I've seen it put out 55 amps. It's a very good charge controller uh, for 12 volts. And uh, yeah, it also runs this dual toaster and all kinds of charging for the cell phones and all kinds of stuff. Anyways, I'll let you guys uh, see me in the next clip. Oh, guys, gotta say, as long as you get rid of the crappy spark plug that comes with this thing, it is a really nice generator. I recommend so far. It folds out, hurts out, 221 hours. I feel like I just got this thing and I've already run 221 hours. I hope it lasts a long time because these are getting hard to get. Home Depot doesn't have them anymore. And uh, they're about $200 more on Furman's website, or $150 more. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this update. See you in the next clip. All right, so we're back at the grandparents' cottage. What are we sitting at for battery voltage? Using 1% load, so the is pretty much just on. 54.4 volts, batteries are pretty much dead. We are getting 470 watts in. And here is the BMS I hooked up. It is balancing, as you can see. Uh, I don't know if you can see. There you go. The, the blinking lights means it's balancing. Uh, so we got 65 amps remaining. We're at 29%. Uh, I think that's a little bit high. We're probably close to like 20 or 19%. Something like that. I got most of the bank hooked up to the BMS. I have this third, that third hooked up. This third is not hooked up yet. Just because it takes time and I just did not have enough time. So I'll be doing that shortly. And uh, yeah, everything's working good though. I have that so it shuts the batteries off once it hits the too low of a voltage. And then that also saves these batteries because they're, they're pretty well all balanced. So works pretty good. Look at that, we got up to 500 watts there. That hits up to 1500 watts. And uh, yeah, it's just the update.